Hello and welcome to Two Minutes of Anatomy. I am Dr. Donald Ozello of Championship Chiropractic in Las Vegas, Nevada. Today's topic on Two Minutes of Anatomy is the iliotibial band, extremely important structure in the lower extremity. Oftentimes, the iliotibial band is shortened to the IT band. You may see that in writing or you may hear that terminology. The iliotibial band is also known as the iliotibial tract. The iliotibial band is a long and wide sheath of tough fibrous connective tissue, much like a ligament that runs the entire length of the lateral thigh. It originates on the iliac crest and it runs inferior passing over the lateral femoral epicondyle and attaching to the anterior lateral aspect of the tibia. That is where the name comes from, the origin and the insertion. The origin is the iliac crest, the insertion is the tibia. So therefore we have the name iliotibial band. The iliotibial band has the tensile strength of soft steel. It has very few, if any, stretch receptors. The iliotibial band serves as the attachment point for the tensor fasciolata muscle and also the attachment point for the gluteus maximus muscle. Its functions are numerous. It helps to stabilize the knee when we're in a standing position. It helps to prevent inward rotation of the knee. It also assists in the flexion and it assists in several hip motions, including external rotation, abduction and extension. 